Life of Early Humans. In this module, you will learn about the life of early humans. Archaeologists have conducted several excavations in order to reconstruct the lives of early humans. From the evidences gathered from these excavations, archaeologists have been trying to find out about where the early humans lived, what they ate and how they communicated. Although many archaeological evidences have been found till date, some of it is conflicting in nature. Study of archaeological evidences has revealed that early humans used to gather, hunt, scavenge and fish for food. Although the evidence in favor of food gathering by early humans is not concrete, the fossil bones of animals and fish certainly suggest that hunting of animals was practiced. Hunting probably began around 500,000 years ago and planned hunting began around 35,000 years ago. This is evident from the fossils found at European sites such as Dolny Westernis located in Czech Republic. Evidences from such sites suggest that people knew about the migration of animals to the riverside and deliberately chose such sites for hunting. Archaeological evidence from the Lazare cave in southern France suggests that between 400,000 and 125,000 years ago, early humans started using caves and open-air sites for habitation purposes. This is evident from a 12 by 4 meter shelter that was found in the cave. Inside this shelter, archaeologists have also found two herds and remains of food such as fruits, vegetables, seeds and fish. Apart from these archaeological finds, thousands of flake tools and hand axes have been found at several sites in Kenya and Ethiopia. These finds are dated between 700,000 and 500,000 years ago. However, the discovery of finer tools such as the spear thrower and the bow and arrow dating back to 35,000 years ago suggest development of advanced hunting techniques. The mode of communication of early humans has always been debated about. While some think that hominid language involves gestures only, others believe that the spoken language of hominids was preceded by singing or humming. Some think that the early communication was similar to calls as seen in primates. Another theory about the origin of language is that it developed around the same time as art, which was about 40,000 to 35,000 years ago, since both art and language were methods of communication. Hence, many people believe that language evolved around the same time as art. Archaeologists have discovered several paintings of animals in the caves of Lascaux and Chauvet in France, and Altamira in Spain. These paintings were done 30,000 to 12,000 years ago and include depictions of animals such as deer, rhinos, lions and owls. It is believed that for several million years humans continued to hunt and gather food. Then between 10,000 to 4,500 years ago, domestication of animals began. People also started farming and many new crops were grown. The use of tools also improved the way of living as the years passed by. Let's recall, early humans gathered, hunted, scavenged and fished for food. Hunting probably began around 500,000 years ago. Planned hunting began around 35,000 years ago. Early humans used caves for habitation between 400,000 to 125,000 years ago. 
Thousands of flake tools and hand axes dated between 700,000 to 500,000 years ago were found at several sites. The discovery of spear thrower and bow and arrow dating back 35,000 years ago suggests the development of newer and advanced hunting techniques. Hominid language only involved gestures. The use of the vocal tract for speech evolved only around 200,000 years ago.